Hey, welcome everyone in this new video tutorial about Diablo like Dungeon Generator. In this video, we are going to do two things. One is we are going to fix the bug that occur occurs when we say that we can step back on a force style which has been created at the beginning of the dungeon. Uh, so this this generates a bug. So if we actually, in here, if we say we have a step back chance, if I'm hitting play like this, I'm going to have an infinite loop. And that's because it's going to create a, a four, and we have a four style specified at the beginning of the dungeon. So it's it is spawning the four style and it's saying it's, it's, it's trying to step back. So we want to go to our generate tile layout function and we want to check our step back function. And we want to see if we want to see if our previous location is actually of a, of type so that's where we are checking if this is a core tile so is this a generic tile if so we can step back if not we are, re we are returning false, and if we return false, we are, we are actually trying to step back one more time, and one more, and one more, and it's actually going infinitely, since we are, we are at the begin of, beginning of the level, and we are clamping the value in here. So we actually need to check in here if the value we are getting out of this int is actually less than 1. Uh, we want to check if it's greater than 0. If it is, we can step back. If it's not, we need to stop the step back. So how can we do that? We will actually add a new parameter in here, which which is going to say success, and we are going to check it there, <coughs> and we are going to copy paste the return node, and we are going to return not success if the value we are getting from our step back function is less than zero. This would mean when when this value is less than is zero or less, that means we step back uh, to the start tile and more, and uh, and we don't want that to happen. So if we go back to our generate tile layout function, we know we now have a pin that says success. So if it is if it is a success, we are going to say our previous is, location is this one. If not, we are going to try to add a new tile a new tile normally, like that. So if I'm going back to our check check for for style function, like that. If I'm saying we have zero percent chance to step back, and then if I'm hitting play. We still have our corridor at the beginning. And now, if I say we have 60% chance to step back, if I'm hitting play, we still have a corridor at the beginning. We have stepping back, the stepping back feature, which is working. And we can actually add stuff at the beginning of our dungeon in the same time. So this fixes the bug. I'm going to say we have 30% chance to step back. And one more thing I wanted us to do was to make it so our replacement tile features checks, checks the directions of the replacement tile we set up in here, check if we actually added check if we actually added that to our force tile. I mean, I wanted to make sure our re the replacement tile we specify in here will always spawn by creating, by automatically creating a force tile that corresponds to the direction of the replacement tile we specify in here. 
but we are we are actually just going to throw on error if we don't manage to spawn some of our replacement tiles and it's going to do the trick for now so when we generate our our replacement style layout we actually loop through our replacement tiles array and i want to duplicate that array and i want to go to one of the functions we create late uh, in the previous video the one which was debugging display for style errors so this is going to be called um, display extra tiles errors we want to click that we want to duplicate the replacement tiles we want to duplicate that we want to break the array element in here to create a for loop of wildcards we want to sequence there we want to first generate the error concerning the for style and then we want to generate the error regarding the replacement tiles we want to get the name of that class we want to grab the print in here fail to spawn so we are just going to say failed to to replace tile fail to place the tile and we're just going to break it like that if i'm hitting compile hitting save this is just going to generate an error so if i'm checking if i'm adding a replacement tiles a replacement tile which is i'm going to say i want a four way a four way where where are they like that i want a four way i'm hitting play it's telling me it failed to generate that but now if i'm saying in the four style i want a uh, four way at the beginning fail to place the four way so it failed to spawn it whereas we actually have a four way so this is going to be for the next video because we didn't check the replacement tiles feeder as of yet but it's supposed to be working so this is going to wrap up the video hope you guys enjoyed it and hope to see you in the next one bye bye